brothers and sisters, and welcome back to another action-packed episode of Chris the Butcher and Friends. And tonight, my brothers and sisters, is going to be a little bit of an experiment. And the experiment is, I'm going to take the classic quarter pounder with cheese from Rustlers that cost me two squid, and I'm going to try and make it better. But let's face it, can't make it any fucking worse. this experiment it's going to give you a quick rundown of what I've got and obviously I've got the classic quarter pounder by Rustlers. I have got some smoked streaky bacon, I've got some mild cheese slices, onions, iceberg lettuce, tomato, tomato, tomatoes, the buns I am going to if I can find it, I will, re I will locate it, I am going to spray them with garlic fry light and I'm going to Make good fucking toasting, and then I'm just basically going to make a new burger, but still using the bun and the shit burger and the sauce and the cheese in there as well. Just make the Russell's burger ten times better, hopefully. Right. There's the muffin. We're going to give it a good dousing and we fucking love garlic fry lights in this house. And I'm going to put them in the oven on low because I want them to crisp up nice and slowly so it, well, so it cooks with everything else. So that is going in the oven. Now we've got our onion. Two nice thick slices, I think we'll do it. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to keep them like that because then are going to go in the cast iron pan with some smoked streaky bacon. Right, let's get cooking. The first thing that's going to go in my frying pan is my onion. Because I want to get that nice and, I want to get it nice and brown, do you know what I mean? This is going to take longer to cook than the actual bacon. Because I've got two, I'm going to put two slices of smoked streaky bacon in there as well. So I'm not going to do it until I've actually turned that onion over. So I'll be back with you when I turn that onion over. Right, unfortunately I don't think I'm going to be able to turn this without it falling apart. Or burning my fingers. So I'm not bothering. Oh, ha ha ha. Look at the state of that. Fuck it. Let's crunch it up. It day matter, does it? Right, I'll put that to one side so it's not as hot. Now we're going to go with our two slices of smoked streaky bacon. Hey, oh, packing out a of me. That's hot. Motherfucking hot. Right, so I'm going to cut them. I'm going to probably take them out of the pan and we're going to throw our shit Rustler burger in there as well. Yes! That is the bacon and the onion's done. Time to warm up the shit Rustler burger. In all that onion. The handle of that is fucking hot by the way. Bastard. In all them juices. So we can pick it all up. Don't forget the burger's already cooked. We just want to warm it up. But essentially, that's if the fire brigade don't turn up. The house, I've smoked the fucking house out completely. Right, so next time you see any of this, I will be building it. Actually, I completely forgot I've got the cheese on. Now we're building it. So we're building this bastard. And as you can see, I've got my muffins. They are the Rustler Burger muffins. Cooked in the oven with garlic fry light. 
So they're quite greasy anyway, so we're going to get our rabbit food on. Like it, it has on the picture, it shows rabbit food on the fucking picture, doesn't it? Right? Then we're going to go in our burger. I couldn't cook it too long, so the cheese hasn't fully melted. Otherwise the burger would going to burn to a fucking crisp. Then we're going to go with our absolutely incinerated smoked streaky bacon. I've got I've got onion, uh, onions and tomatoes here. I don't know whether to use both on or one or yeah. anyway. Definitely grab them burnt onions on. Fuck it. Burnt onions. Do you know what? I'm sorry, people. I'm going to leave the tomatoes off. I'm not a mad fan of tomatoes, so I'm leaving them off. But I am going to use the sauce that you get with a Russell burger. If I can get in it, I ain't got. I have got a pair of scissors, courtesy of Phil somewhere, but I don't know what the fuck I've done with them. I'm gonna put it on. I'm gonna put it on the bun. If I can hit it. So that is Rustler's signature sauce, crudely dispensed onto the bun. That's the lid going on. We'll get down here and we'll have a good look at it. But that is my how to make a Rustler burger. Ten times fucking better. What could I say? That is going to be ten times better than a Rustler burger. I know I've had to piss around and jump through fucking hoops to do it. But it's still the Rustler burger bun. The Rustler burger cheese is under the cheese I added. And it's still the Rustler burger. As you can see there though. I left it in the pan a little bit too long and it is kind of burnt. But at least you know it's fucking cooked. Right, anyway, let's get up here and slide it down me gizzard. There it is, my brothers and sisters. I just took an original Rustler's cheeseburger and made it ten times fucking better. Now let's get it down me gizzard. That my brothers and sisters. Cooking that Russell burger in the frying pan, even though I did burn it a little bit. It's giving it kind of like a proper You know it cooked on the barbecue taste. Like a proper, proper burger. And plus I burnt the onions. In fact I burnt the fucking lot near enough apart from the muffin. Which is unbelievable because I normally burn the fucking muffin. The small streaky bacon was a crisp. <laughs> uh, I didn't burn the lettuce, but then again, I didn't cook that fucker. Anyway, the taste on that is absolutely fucking superb. I'm going to burger and everything else, it only cost me about three and a half quid. Right. Like, me and this super in fucking proved Rustler burger and we're quite like sticky Boston. We can rebuild you. The six million dollar burger! <laughs> Move over Luke! This is coming to bed with me tonight. <sighs> so my brothers and sisters that was my experiment. If I could take a classic cheeseburger rustler and make it better. And you know what? In my opinion, I fucking did. Right? You guys might not think I did. Or you might, oh, you fucking mess with a fucking something that's perfect. Well, if you think a rustler's burger is perfect, then you need to throw yourself off a fucking pier somewhere. And hope the tide's fucking out. <laughs> right, anyway. I reinvented that, reinvented that, I redid that, I didn't invent it at all. But I love that. If you like this, press like, comment, 
share it on your social media and subscribe I'll become a family member of hashtag team CTB where I fucking love you